Dave's videos. So it's great resources and follow the links and make sure to watch them all. Right, so it's that time of the show where we do the school thing, where we teach you something. School, school time! time. Da, 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 da. We tell, don't have a sound effect for that. No, no right. sound effects. So this week, um, it's Anthony's turn to teach us something. And what Anthony's going to show you is how you can add sound effects to triggers. So when you trigger an animation for your character, you can also trigger a sound effect. Anthony, the school time board is still on the screen. The school board is gone. <laughs> okay, the school board is gone. Right, Anthony, there you go. Okay, it's just a very quick one today. We're just going to, um, a few people we've seen ask the same question about how to add audio triggers uh, to co coincide with uh, keyboard triggers in Character Animator. There's probably a quite a few different softwares out there to do this. We found a free one called, what's it called? Sound Plants, and we'll add a link in the description. And I mean, I've probably spent about 10 minutes looking at it, and it's very simple to set up. Um, on my character animator character, my trigger to set the character to spin its head is D. So as you can see in this setup on Soundplant, the key D has an audio file attached to it. And it's a simple case of just going to... Where are you? Okay, let's see. We want to say do, do, do G. Open a sound. Select a sound from there. And then that. whenever you press that, and there's different set up settings for this, you want to make sure hold down and this is the important bit background key input is selected to on so now when you select those keys and make you have to make sure that you've got character animator selected so you can pr uh, the triggers will work that will run in the background I'm going to turn on the audio for the desktop so you can hear it working though we're having some issues with the desktop audio at the moment so it might be a bit crackly but it will give you a good idea of how it sounds Okay, here. Ah! Oh, like I said, you have to have your character animator selected. Ah! Ah! So, I mean, basically, if you wanted to um, add sound effects. Yeah, if you wanted to add sound effects, you know, you want to do a laughing sound, and every time he laughs, you want to add that on. Yeah, but it's also good for props. So, if you've got a character playing, you do tar. If you've got a character with a laser gun, or you know, if you've got an animal character with a roar, you know, when you press the trigger for them to blast the gun, shoot the lasers, uh, make an explosion, um, whatever, now you can actually have sound effects. You know, it's such an important part of animation. I personally think this is actually a really big deal. Yeah, no, it's a really, it's something like I said, we've only played around with for about 10 minutes, but I think. There's a lot that you can do with it, and when I get a bit more time, I'll make a full proper tutorial on how to set it up, and you know, set up a whole load of keyboard triggers and show how they all work, and give it a bit more um, investigation. But I think it's just another thing, another automated thing, and especially if you've got something like the Power Grid set up on your mobile phone, or you've got the Elgato Stream Deck, you know, you can just sit there and tap away and get your character doing all sorts of stuff. So it could be a really good one for gamers. You know, if they've won a game, they can do a celebration and it'll play, you know, a fanfare. I mean, ideally, we could have one to press every time the school, bo uh, school board comes up so we can have actual sound effect and things you know, like that. You know, that school board is supposed to come from the bottom up, not drop down. Well, like yeah, that. That's the way, yeah. <laughs> oh, well. <laughs> right, okay. Well, normally it's that time of the show where we ask people to send us questions that we all answer live but obviously we've been doing that a lot when Dave was here so I don't imagine we've got any questions for us do we Ant? Um, nope I think that I think we've pretty much answered everything but if there are any other questions that we've missed um, just put them in the comments on the uh, video once it's finished um, and we'll get back to you and answer anything that we can just in case people missed it, um, obviously last week we didn't do a live show because Anthony was 
off on holiday. Um, so I uploaded a mini episode and basically we've had um, a situation where we've had characters who've got lots and lots and lots of triggers and eventually you seem to, you know, you can run out of keys on the keyboard because for character animator you can, as far as I'm aware, you can only use um, your numbers and your letters. Yeah, that's right. And, you know, you've, you've only got so many on the keyboard. But we have come up with a way where you can actually get a lot more um, buttons available. So, anyway, I'll put a link below, but if you look up, what was it called? Yeah. If you look for our video, which was called Character Animator Tutorial with Digital Puppets, More Trigger Buttons, look that up on our channel, and last week I explained exactly how to do that. Okay, then. We also want to say thanks oh. to everyone who's uh, asked questions on the live chat and, um, and are watching us live. Um, we appreciate you getting involved. And like I say, make sure to uh, tune in next week. And we will be doing this every week now. And just answering as many questions as we can. Try and help out as much as Do we can. Do you have any idea whether or not this worked on Twitter? Um, no idea at all. Um, I'll find out as soon as it's finished. <laughs> <laughs> well, is there anybody, watch, uh, anybody watching live that can check on Twitter for us and tell us if it's working? Any comments, Antoine? There is not. So um, we will we'll check after the show. I think we need to wrap it up now. <laughs> okay. And right, okay then. We will see everybody That's it. next week. Time to say goodbye. Bye. Bye.